Hey there, everybody. Fett here, and welcome back to Fett Plays Wasteland 3. We've got the uh, skeletal remains of an abandoned exurb here. And we're going to enter it. We've got Team 3 going down. Hydro Hippo, Parish, Iron Chef Bear, Enrico. And there's somebody running away here. And we're going to try to find him. And apparently they're still here. Thankfully, we have our truck right behind us, so... We're prepared to defend ourselves. That's your warning shot. Stupid bitch! Take cover and be careful. The boss wants these two alive. You gonna let us talk to him? Let's find out. Mercenary hothead, huh? Alright, turn around. Start with Enrico, just in case they aren't going to let us talk to him. Let's see, is there a one-hit kill we can get somewhere? No, they got a lot of health. These are some healthy boys. All right. Start by marking one of them. All right. Oh, we can handle it, all right. Yeah, we need to move the truck up first. Take three AP to do that. I only spend two, it only gets me to here. We can still shoot from there, so I think it still might be worth. Oh, yeah, it's worth. Get him! Mmm, baby. Alright. Jody. Let's actually go ahead and pull out a turret. Let's pull out a machine turret, just a regular one. Get that on the battlefield to take some of the heat from the enemies. Thank you. Take a shot on this guy in the back. There we go. That was a lucky action, so go ahead and duck. And save some points. Lucia, go hide somewhere, please. <laughs> and who knows, maybe you won't die right away. Defend. Parrish, you're going to hold up. Enrico. Go ahead and duck. And take a shot. Oh my god! He missed with a 95%. I'm upset. I'm genuinely upset about that. Come on, dude. Some crap right there. Alright. Um, Hydro. You wait. Perish. I'd love to get a nice shot down that way. Run over here. Right on this guy. Good stuff. Alright, and then defend yourself for a turn. Oh, Hydro, you're a little trickier. Uh, let's go with a shot on the hothead. See if we can get that flame tank knocked out. No dice, but a lot of damage on him. Ooh, there's a free move, too. Nice. Get him, then. That's another free move! He's getting them all! We can get just a little bit... Ah, he's not gonna get close enough. Alright, get over here. Another free move. Um, Go into ambush stance. Alright, here they come. This guy's got fire. Some of them are... Wow! Jesus! I thought Parrish had more health than that. I genuinely thought he had more health than that. What the heck? Uh, let's go ahead and mark Flame Boy. And then try taking out that tank. 59%. That works too! Alright. A kill is a kill, you know? Okay, go ahead and defend yourself for the rest of this turn. Lucia, is anyone in range? Yeah, we do have a couple in range. Okay. 67, 81. Go for the trick shot. Beautiful. And then turn that trick shot into a headshot. Beautiful. And then turn that headshot into a snapshot. Hot damn. She's squishy as hell, but when she does get hit shots in, they hurt. 
Okay. Defend yourself. How much health does Parrish have? 163? How much damage did he take? I swear he didn't take that much. Ah, eh, well. Hmm. Enrico. Go ahead and actually just take and aim the shot here. Good stuff. Save up for next turn. Chef Bear! This is a good spot for you to be in. Now, the only question is, do I want to use my rocket or not? And I'm thinking... Hmm. It's a chance of taking out both of these guys. Let's go for it. Really? Alright. Reload. Swap. Don't have enough room to punch, so just go ahead and defend yourself. He lit himself on fire, but he didn't... Well, he didn't do damage to himself. Uh, Hydro. Well, this is awkward, isn't it? With this guy right here. 6%? No, we're not taking a 6% shot. 41%? Alright, over here. Take a shot. That should give us... It was a lucky shot. Go with the headshot. Okay. Not enough lucky shots, though. Go ahead and shoot him again. Hopefully your luck will, will last. Okay, spend two points. Move up again. Cool. Uh, I can't get both of them? What? What? Okay. That seems a little weird. Could just slam this that over there, but no, nah, that's not close enough either. I think our turret will take that one out, so you know what? Go ahead and back up our, our boy over here. There you go. Beautiful. Save your points. Good job, Morningstar! Come on, dude! He just shot his own guy! <laughs> that was beautiful. Party pal, I know you think you're helping, but... You're not helping that much. Jody, you're in an interesting spot here. Shoot. You actually have cover now. Okay. Lucy, should be able to finish this guy off. That didn't do it? What? There we go. Snapshot took him out. And then we could have her hot come up here and hide. And then take a... Oh, that's considered blocked, huh? Alright, makes sense. I don't like it, but it makes sense. Let's go ahead. Hmm. Deals extra damage and reduces bonus damage. Let's do this one. I want to reduce his hit chance. There we go. Got it all. Beautiful. Enrico, what do we got? Nothing from here. Okay. So we need to move you up. Gotcha. Alright. Now you got some good stuff. These the only two left? I guess they are. Alright, go up the mercenary commando then. Well, that was nice. I just gotta take out this soldier and we're good to go. Come on, boy! Think he's so tough. All right, Hydro, uh, you're going to have to actually move around, so let's just move you over here for now. Cool. Save a point. Let's go ahead and throw down an in Intimidation shot over here. There you go. Take out that cover. Maybe, uh, well... Ooh, we can shoot again. Neat. Can we shoot anywhere that actually hits the enemy, though? Doesn't look like it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That might do it. Ow. <laughs> For great justice, Parrish uh, got a twisted wrist. He'll live, though. Heal him up. Need to heal up Chef Bear, who was in the middle of the crap. That's okay. There you go. And then a little bit for Parrish. Did we get an actual level up? Yeah, Jody got an actual level up. 
So let's give her more intel because she's got a lot of skills she's paying for our team. Uh, we could up her sniper all the way. But I think I'm actually going to invest in more first aid. She's really good at it. Reviving allies has a chance of buffing them. Yeah, let's actually do that. There we go. Okay. That could end up helping out a lot in the long run. Uh, Hydro Hippo also got a level up. Missed the luck over here. Just gotta give him some smots to go with that luck. And then maybe a little bit more into small arms. That's right, small arms. That's what we call them now. Uh, let's go ahead and grab the loot, and then we're good to go. Uh, ammo. Scrap. Scrap ammo. Scrap dollars. Ammo junk. And more junk. Okay. And then some ammo boxes. Well, it was a box, and it did have ammo in it. Should probably have a Hydro Bee running around these, just in case we can get a lucky something or other. Ooh, a grip. Extra hit chance on melee? Hell yeah. Happy to have that. I don't know why Lucy was the one to do that, but whatever. Uh, drug stash. See what we got. Drugs. Who'd have thought? And then we can come talk to these two. Rangers, you look like prayers answered. I knew Jesus wouldn't abandon us. You know it, huh, Kim? So, uh, glad to be a service that you take care of now. Uh, so, what's going on here? Those goons were set by a thug named Moss Kogan. Mm. They were trying to take my sister. I thought it'd be enough to leave Colorado Springs, but... Well, that doesn't sound good. In hindsight, I suppose it might have been stupid. Probably. Of course they'd follow us. But I didn't know what else to do. We're in over our heads. If you hadn't stepped in when you did... Radio, huh? Attention, Rangers. This is Moss Kogan of the Hundred Family. Oh, boy. <sighs> of the Hundred Families, huh? outside and we are armed and dangerous outside of this little fortification or outside of ranger hq but this doesn't need to come to violence i am a reasonable man and i am happy to negotiate i mean it was probably a silly question but i'm basically my question was how dumb are you please rangers whatever he's saying it oh, please don't let them take my sister they'll hurt her I mean, yeah, that was that was what I was figuring. So why are they after Yoon? Well, if you work things out, this is your mess. No, why are they after her? He wants his money back, but he's going to have to take an organ instead. I don't have it. Despite her bravado, Yoon's face is drawn with, and her eyes are frightened. Yoon. <laughs> she borrowed money from Kogan. That wasn't smart. Too much money. But it was only so we could create a church. A place that other Catholics could... I did it because I wanted to spend money on dumb shit, okay? Mm. I... Shit! I'm too much of a fuck-up to deserve help, but my sister... She's gonna suffer too if Kogan catches up with us. Help us, please. For her sake. Seems like excessive force on Kogan's part. Come on, we'll help you work things out. <laughs> There's only one fate... For thieves like you, no, 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 we're not, we're not nearly that much on the, uh, 100 family side. It seems like excessive force on their part. I may have stolen the money. And that makes more sense. It all at the Little Vegas. That makes a lot more sense. Lady Luck just doesn't like me, I guess. Yoon, I, it's my fault. If there was a parish, if I had some way of raising her better, I mm -hmm. might have been able to steer her away from gambling. But that doesn't matter now. I get the feeling you two are not on the same side religiously. Anyway, we'll have you work things out with Kogan. Let's see you, Rangers. All right. Let's see how this ends up going. Medical crate. Nice. Oh, they're out. This is what you mean by out front. All right. Let's take a look here. Commandos, soldiers, just more of the same mercenary robots. 
There's Kogan. Ammo boxes, crates. This doesn't look like anything that uh, we haven't taken on before. We won't have our truck, which will definitely suck. But we have rockets. And they will flare if they decide to make some trouble. Now see here, Ray. He is a low-life thief. I've heard. She deserves the Patriarch's justice for stealing from me. However, I'm a reasonable man. All I want is my money. Those two can go where they like after that, so long as they promise I'll never have to lay eyes on them again. I mean, that's more than your money you want, then. Maybe we can pay off her debt. Keep shouting all you want, but your money's gone. There's no way of getting it back. How about she spends a few years in indentured servitude? Do what you want. This isn't our problem. I mean, that was probably the plan any either way. Um, I mean, your money's gone. There's no getting it back. Maybe that's true. I'm just concerned this will start a fight, and I don't want to do that yet. I do want to tell them that that's the fact, but... Mm. Yeah. I hope you'll pardon my language, Rangers, but fuck that! One way or another, I will be compensated. Mm-hmm. Maybe we could pay off her debt? How much is it? Ten thousand dollars? Holy money, shit. Why not? You have enough jangling around in all those pockets? Yeah, we definitely don't have that kind of money. Damn right you don't. Have any other bright ideas? Uh yeah. Got your payment right here. There you go. Perish. We'll pay you in rockets, bitch. Come on, I can get that last one in there. Okay, maybe I can't. That's okay. This is still a really good rocket. There's your payment. You rat fucks. You're not done? Oh, here's some more. There is someone's alarm going off behind me. Uh, anyway. <laughs> Ah, that's not enough damage. Damn it. Uh, one sec. How embarrassing. Anyway. <laughs> He's not dead? Ah, oh, I thought that would have killed that guy for sure. Uh, perish, move to the side. Okay, who's next? Enrico? Uh, let's have you wait, actually. Chef Bear. You know exactly what to do, dude. Well, how y'all feeling now? Alright, Hydro. Let's go ahead and get you into a defensive position. Well, maybe not, maybe not. Uh, Jody, let's actually start with you. Get you right here. Let's get this last machine turret into an offensive position. There we go. Okay. And then hole up and prepare to defend. Uh, Lucy, you got a really good spot here to defend from. Let's go ahead and start here. Go into ambush, although I don't think that's going to do much for us now that I think about it. Uh, Hydro, why don't you head down this way? And since you didn't get a lucky move, let's go ahead and just have you defend. Eriko, who do you got a bead on? Mostly anyone. Well, mostly. A couple of you are covered. So we're probably going to want to move out a bit. Actually, if we move over to the other side here, can we hit that servitor bot? From right here we should be able to, but... How good is that cover? Oh, that's perfect, actually. Right here. This is where I want you, Eriko. Lap that bot. He's, it's still blocked? Damn it. I thought I had him from there. Okay. Who do we have from right here? I wish I could see it better than that. 70. That's actually a better odds than we had a second ago. Go for it. Beautiful. Duck and cover. Turret time. Turret's doing about what I expected. And thankfully, they do have to move in. 
which is huge for us. Lucia did get an ambush shot off. <laughs> Shooting their own, dude. All right, Jody. Let's go ahead and get this party. Well, continuing. That is a lot of action points, and I love it. Lucia, can we get off a trick shot here? 29%. Uh, well, wait. Ooh, 69. Perfect. Um, there you go. That's what we want to be. Want to have that height advantage. Duck. 69! Works every time. Now shoot him in the head. That was minimum damage. That's probably okay, though. I actually think this will work out for us. Just take shots. Uh, one more. Frick. Perish. Swap weapons. Let's get the blap blapping, my dude. Uh, 77 from here. Okay. This is probably the best spot, then. Go here. Duck. Don't do single shots. Just shoot his ass. There you go. Good stuff. Got a nice lucky shot in there, too. Lucky mega crit as well. All right. Good damage from Enrico. Hold up for the rest of the turn. Um, Chef Bear. Can you make it over here and hit him? Oh my, I think he can. Guy has such a ridiculous amount of movement. Um, and then Hydro can finish him off. Frick. Hydro can finish him off. There you go. Okay, and then defend. One to go. Whoop. Oh, I was hoping the machine turret would take him out. I was hoping so badly. Ah! Thanks, bot. Okay. Let's waste as little good ammo as we can by just doing this. Perfect. Well, that was easy. Sorry you got frozen there, Hydro. You seem to be okay, though. Mission complete. Burn book. Colorado dollar. History of the Tibia. A few other things and my jigs. All right, how they doing? Thanks, Rangers. I, uh... Shit. I really messed up that time, didn't I? Yeah, you did. I can't keep expecting Kim to bail me out. I'm gonna do better from now on. Promise. All right, what will you do now? Whatever Kim tells me to at this point. We'll need to keep our heads down for a while after this mess. Yeah, tell us about yourself. You seem uh, a lot different than Kim. Yeah, I was the black sheep of a good Catholic family. Okay, I saw that coming. Couldn't wrap my mind around the idea of a god that gave a shit. Not after all this. Yeah, I get that. Where is, uh... Where'd Kim go? Oh, there she is, on the other side. I suppose this could have ended worse. God willing, we'll see better days soon. Keep open. Not much, but please take this. Refugees love us. Mm -hmm. A little bit of fame. Tell us about yourself while the rewards roll in. There is... It's probably a Bible. <laughs> to say, really. I was a cook for one of the hundred Ooh. families... Yoon was a troubled child, but I know it was one of the Lord's tests. He's training her, preparing her for greater glories. I'm sure. What will you do now? I don't know. I don't think it's safe for us to go back to Colorado Springs, so we'll figure it out. God will guide us. All right. Well, best of luck with that. Uranium pendant, huh? Is it junk, or is it an actual item? It is, unfortunately, junk. Alright. Well, that's too bad. Not unbelievable, but too bad. Uh, looks like we've got some more level ups to go around. Enrico, getting you close to that top level of coordination. And yeah, I think we're going to hold on to the rest of your points for now. Chef Bear, also getting close to the top coordination marks. Nice. Yo, toaster repair. Yo! Toaster repair, dudes! Whoa, 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 there's a toaster up here. 
Get, get your ass up here. Repair it. Take this, toaster. He's done it. Tarjan token. A machine turret. Disco bot. $54. Our boy has done it. All right. I know there's a lot more of them that we've actually missed. Oh, there was a gas pump here I could have lit on fire. Could have just lit that sucker right up. Mining mallet. A big old hammer. Neat. Have no use for it, but neat. All right, and everything else, just a little bit of ammo. Ooh, there's a safe over here. We do not have the lock picking for that. Um, Mystic might have the lock picking for that. If we came all the way back over here. Anyway, we're good to go. Nice little side mission. Barter is one of the most important skills in the wasteland. If you don't know how to barter, you'll only sell items for 5% of their regular value. Well, that would suck, wouldn't it? Surprised we didn't get a screaming at by the hundred families for that. Uh, this is big old empty spot over here. Pass us to the other side there. Okay, that's fine. Is this a bridge? Oh, it is a bridge. November, I'm getting erratic high frequency bursts near your location. You may want to check it out. Cautiously, of course. Of course, Copy HQ. Can you pinpoint the location? Affirmative, November. It's like a spotlight in the dark. Sending coordinates over and out. All right. More interesting things to look at. Uh, did you send the coordinates? It's not the ghost town. Not Union Station. Hmm. Well, that's weird. Uh, you know what? I kind of want to do this one next. Do we know where he is? I don't think we do. Yeah, I think we just have to find him. Anyway, let's see what's down here. Well, a smell of hot metal and hotter oil fills the Kodiak. Figure it might be overheating. You stop to take a look. Smell stronger outside. It's robots. Take advantage of the train to escape, or we can use weird science. Uh, let's take advantage of the terrain here, because we don't have the weird science to give us an advantage. You pile the Kodiak... And drive up on an icy hill. Their metal feet have difficulty getting purchased on the slick slope. And we leave them behind. Alright, what is that? I mean, it's a Tesla coil. But it's an abandoned oil well. An ancient town reclaimed by a foggy forest. Which hides the houses that it destroyed. Interesting. We're probably getting to areas we should not be at yet. The Gravitron Shredder is a heavy weapon that destroys its target with a blast of gravitic... A gravitic? It's a gravitic? Anyway, uh... Alright, bye, truck. So... These are apparently all juvies. Hi. Hey, kids, you know anything about the strange signals coming from this area? Seen anything weird around here? What's with the mask? It's not Halloween. Why are you kids wearing gas masks? The air is perfectly safe here. Some extra experience for that. Um, are you the victims of some kind of experiment? The grandchildren of MK Ultra victims? Were you taken by UFOs? Were you all dropped on your heads or fed asbestos? Do the first one. All right. Yeah. Nope. Nothing out of there. Okay. Well, that's uh cool. Yeah, this is uh, perfectly cromulent and interesting. They have some buried items. Very nice. A couple of medic packs. Oh, and another safe that requires lock picking. Huh. I get the feeling we're supposed to come back here later. <laughs> Maybe. Whoa, blech, words. Cold, heat, and explosive damage all ignore armor. However, some enemies have special elemental resistances. Good for them. That was weird. Mm. Well, that's that. That seems like a good sign. Yeah, that seems good. Um, we're getting radiation damage here. Holy crap. I didn't think there was a place where you could get more, but we found it. All right. 
I guess that just tells you that not all of Colorado is available to us yet. Where you go? I guess... We'll explore the rest of this area out here, because this is probably relatively safe. And we'll be heading into that area later. Ooh, come on, keep going. Very nice. Back to the Colorado Springs area. What do you got? Band of Godfishers are praying to the sky. They have not set a patrol. Alright. You catch them with their leather pants down. And the battle begins. Always happy to take out Godfishers. There's some interesting dudes. And there they are. Okay, battle begins right away. And we're going to start it with a little bit of howitzer. Mm, yes. God, that's fun. <laughs> Alright, they're done. Let's see, Jody. Let's go ahead and actually mark one of these suckers. Yeah, there you go. I knew we'd have a pennant over here. You found it. Uh, right, guys? That's right. Get him. Oh, yeah, baby. Crouch. Defend. Lucia, Let's see what we can do about this one. Uh, can we get a trick shot? No, not not up there. We can't. Um, what if you were to get close and then try a trick shot? I'm taking a risk here. It's a big one. I'm not gonna lie, but it's paying off. She got a free hit, free move from that too, so it's paying off hugely. Woo! Oh yeah, come over here. Take this one out too. Okay, one more of those. We've maximized usage here. Ah, oh, come on. There it is. Damn, that was good stuff. Okay, going to ambush. Perish. Let's go ahead and switch weapons here. All right. Let's see. 78 right here. Go for it. Good shooting. Hot damn. Defend for this turn. Enrico. Duck. Mark. None of them have that much. Looks like... Ah, there's a pen in it in the back. Okay. One humiliating beating coming up. All right. Well, he's a goner. See ya. And then save your points. Chef Bearer. I'm going to have you run over here. Actually, hold this side of the bridge. Try to come up here. Okay. Hydro. I'd love you to be in cover, dude. This will work. Stay right here. Hold the line. Lucky evade, and a really good shot, too. Oh. Ow. The heathens are exposed. Ow, the heathens. Gods of the sky. I don't know why he sounds like that. Why does his voice remind me of hedonism, bot? Mm, the heathens are exposed. Okay. We're, we're late, Adam. Uh, Hydro, you need to get out of there. Like, really badly. Scoot out. And then, uh, we're gonna scoot in right here. I love it. When a plan comes together. Bitch. <laughs> Alright. Fantastic. Now for you. You daft bastard. Ah! It freaking went off. Okay. That's okay. We still got him. Try a snapshot. Nah, try it again, Lucia. There it is. Woo! God, these guys are good. Just shows what happens when you give them some good equipment. Alright. We we're plenty healthy now. Go ahead and grab 
what they have, which is mostly just crap, but they got cash. Some of them have cra cash, and that's worth a lot to us, you know? Gotta get some of these... Ooh. Gotta get some of these random battles out of the way just to get the cash. Alright, Lucia. Leveled up. Level 18. Nice. Now let's give you more luck. Because I feel like we need more luck. And I think we're going to save up for that small arm skill. Get that maxed out. If we did that, we'd get counter-offensive. But that's not a, that amazing. Your entire party finds 25% bonus ammo when looting. Aww! Should have gotten that before we looted. That's okay. Um, perish. More luck, please. And then your, I mean, the weapon skills all the way up already. Let's actually give you automatic weapons, because that way, when you do get another level up, we could go ahead and give you double tap. Yeah, that's a good one. Actually, a very good one. All right, and that is everyone ready to go, team. That was a good little fight. Hello, goat. How you doing, goat? He looks like he's doing good. Back to Colorado. Each time you level up, you earn three skill points. Upgrading skills starts out cheap. Becomes more expensive. Okay. We're going this way, though. I don't know why it turned us around. We're just doing some exploration right now. You don't understand how it is. We'll be heading to Aspen, don't worry. That's their ultimate goal. These guys, presumably, are gonna clear Aspen for us. Okay, and then the usual suspects will go ahead and take on the final Buchanan kid. Again, presumably. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm not finding too much around here worth talking about. Another battle. Drools. Okay. Oh, we don't have the sneaky shit? Well, attack them before they attack us. That's always good. That's always a good option. And the drool stuff is worth money. Can't deny that. I'm almost tempted to go back to the commune and see what other upgrades are available for these guys. Nope, that one was just sliding. Come and get it, scumbag. Okay. First, let's see what's available for... Okay, this is good. These guys need to go down as soon as possible. So, I would love to target them first. How many are there? Well, there don't seem to be that many. There's enough to be kind of worrisome, but not a lot. I love it. Okay. Then Morningstar saves some points. Jody, go ahead and duck. And take one of these guys. Well. Let's actually mark this one, because he has so much health. Okay. And then we'll take this one out, though. Cool. Damn, exploders need to go out, go down before they get us in melee range. If possible. Well, we tried, and we didn't get it. 41% is not good. Just shoot and run. Okay, perish. You actually, uh, let's see. If we move up a s two steps, 65%. That's about as good as we're going to get, huh, with this gun. I mean, we get better if we duck, obviously. There we go. Okay. This might be able to take him out. Look at them flames. Oh, so close. All right. Elico, duck. Mark someone else. Beating coming up. And let's actually shoot the bomber. Yeah, there you go. That's the one we need to do damage to. Uh, Chef Bear! Unfortunately, your best move is to use the rocket. And I only say unfortunately because I'd rather him not. Because <laughs> we don't have that many of them. But... That's his best source of damage right there. Without getting into melee range. Reload. Swap weapon. 
Save points. Save, save points. Oh, no, no, don't move. Oh, okay. Whoops. Uh, well. That sucked. I had to move up. Take a shot. Cool. And then we will wait for that guy, I think. So go ahead and defend. Yeah, you're gonna just... You're gonna blow up at the... Oh, my God. Ugh, this game. Oh, well. It's not the game's fault. It's more yelling at the mechanics than what actually happened there. Like I said, that one's not the game's fault. Still pisses me off, though. Um, shit. Throw some healing down, Jody. We got a lot of people who need it, Jody. You actually got rid of your own, uh, or got rid of uh, Lucia's damage with that. That's pretty good. At least I think you did. Because she doesn't have it anymore. Uh, okay. Try the trick shot. There you go. 51% chance. I had to work sometime, right? Um, go ahead and duck for better accuracy. Shoot him in the head. We need to kill him. Preferably right now. Before he gets a chance to move up. Again. Okay. Two more. Damn it. One more. Okay, good. I think that might have been enough. To help. Ah, damn it. Not enough. Hydro, can you get over here and get the kill? Oh, yeah, you should be able to get the kill now that you're here. That'll do it. Okay, and it was a lucky shot, too. So. Well, no, it wasn't. It was a lucky crit, I think. Alright. Stun this fool of a ghoul. Nice. And then shoot him. Also nice. Damn, these explosions are nice. There he go. Duck. And then... Well, shoot. And then save up. Chef Bear, I think we're in a position where you can start fighting. Oh, there's another bio bomber. I didn't even notice. Okay. This is fine, though. He moved in close this turn. And we have time to get away. So that's what's important. So, step back one. Duck. Shoot. Save points. Jody. Back. Duck. Trick shot. That require no skill at all. That's because you missed, Lucia. Doesn't require much skill to miss. Alright, well, keep trying. There it is. He's gonna have to reload too. Uh, back. And he doesn't have to duck here because he's uh he's got cover. Dang it! Oi, oi, oi! Having some bad luck here. Well, this will change our luck. No, 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 no. Is he still marked? He's no longer marked. Oh well, still shoot him. Good damage. Shoot him again. Also good damage. Chef Bear, kill him, hopefully. One. Two. Three. We're reducing his, um... His armor, but not quick enough. Four. Dang it. Okay. Well. Come on, Hydro. There we go. That's honestly all we needed from you. Because if you do that, then Morningstar can do this. And we're done. Woo! Got a little iffy, I'm not gonna lie. A little bit. What do we get? Rags, rags, meat, heart. Heart's the quote-unquote good stuff from them. Any boxes? Possibly full of ammunition that would have extra ammunition because of our setup. Doesn't look like it. I mean, I guess I'm not surprised that a bunch of drools... Don't have boxes full of stuff. Yeah, not surprised. Just sad. Oh no, never, never mind. It's over here. We got it. Give me that ammunition. All right. A little bit of extra of everything 
25, uh, 7 energy cells. Not bad, not bad. Less than I think we used it for the most part. And that's what's important. Let's go. Patriarch has three exiled, exiled heirs. Yeah, I'm aware. We caught one of them. We're heading after uh, Vic now. At least in theory. Okay. That was good stuff. Beautiful, beautiful rock formations over here, though. Okay. And there's the old Hoon home homestead. Puts us right here. No, we actually want to go down the other way. Okay. This way. Off we go. And then that's uh, Colorado, so we're going to want to head up through here. Whoop. Didn't mean to run that over. There you go. Now we're theoretically heading in the right direction. Hmm. Small icy cave. At least there's no wind. Uh, search the area. Animals have been here recently. They could still be around. Uh, take turns watching. Track them and kill them for food. See if they left any food. Uh, let's see if they come back. The animals didn't come back. Everyone got a decent night's rest. You feel great when you wake up. Well, healing. That's something. Good stuff indeed. Wait, am I going... I'm not going the right way. Dang it! <laughs> but we didn't encounter that last time. At least I don't think so. That was 100% a random encounter. I like it. I like the way the random encounters... Random map encounters can show up in this game. I'm telling you, I love almost everything about this game. Except for the out-of-combat controls. That's like the only thing that I really have a gripe with. Once we're in combat, though, everything's savvy. So, can't complain. Into the Rockies! Probably need to go this way. You know, the way we haven't gone before. Hello! A cache. As you get closer, you see it's a lovingly made wooden shrine open at the front, but covered with a pitched roof. You get out to examine it and see that placed on the altar within is a broken toaster. Ooh, the warmth that transforms. Hey, Chef Bear Man, repair it. Oh, how the heck did that get in? What? What? Spectrum assault everything, apparently. Inside the helmet, the air is active filtered and all the audio is digital. It is sounds and feels like the mask is open to the air around you. 8 armor, 12 critical chance. 8 armor, 3 speed. The soft elements of the suit are non-Newtonian, hardening at the instant of impact. The powered frame cancels the weight of the armor, so it's almost like wearing clothing. Cochise, supposedly... I mean, I'm sorry, Cochise. Uh, supposedly designed this tech back when it still liked humans. Under the exoskeleton, the suit's fabric moves like metallic silk. Ups detection time, ups initiative, and 9 armor. It's actually just as armored as what he's wearing now. I mean, he made it. He, he found it, I should say. He should get to wear it, right? Oh my god. Chef Bear is an iron warrior. Look at him. That's amazing. He found it in a toaster, dudes! He found that armor in a toaster! I don't even... Hello. Nah, yes. Drools. More drools. Uh, use your knowledge of the flora and fauna to escape. Nah, nah, nah. Use your medical knowledge to get an advantage. Yeah, yeah. Get them. Sick them. Kick their butts. I mean, that is the plan. We're all lined up. Oh, that's a lot of them? Although they are all, they're a bunch of regular drools, it looks like. So they're not extremely powerful. A couple of lost souls. No exploders from what I can see. So that's, that's good. Very good for us. I think we can hit all three of them right here. So let's do that. Love it when a plan comes together. Okay. Go ahead and prepare for next turn. Jody. Duck. Go ahead and mark the target. Is there only one leader? I think there is. The rest of them are lost souls. So mark the leader. 
And then let's slap this boy. As hard as we can. That's a good slap. Cool. And I saw the container up there, too, so that's nice. Ah, uh, Lucia. You're in trouble. Head over here. I mean, what else is she's always in trouble? Um, 50%, 50%. You know what? Take the 50. That was a 50-50 prick. Uh, headshot, please. And then defend yourself. Barish. 72% from here. We'll take it. Nice damage. Nice damage again. Beautiful. Defend yourself. Eliko. Crouch. We already got an aimed shot on this one, so I feel like we should just take it. However, we can mark another one. So let's go ahead and mark this lad. Okay. And then shoot the lost soul. Chef Bear! Let's have you head up this way. Thankfully, we can already go through their armor. They don't have much. And that one's bleeding. Which is very good for us. Okay, Hydro. Uh, we're just going to hope the best for you. Good shot. Good shot again. And here they come. Uh-oh. Oh, God, Hydro! Yeah, he's down. No shocker there. Friggin' hell! Damn, they're just busting through Bear's armor, too! Holy crap! What the hell? The lost soul getting a shot in. Okay. This seems bad. But, honestly, it's excellent. You dumb fricks. You dumb shits. Alright. <laughs> that was great. I mean, not great for Hydro, but great for everyone else. Uh, you know, I was actually worried that our, we would be too close to get some good shots here, but apparently not. Cool. Lucia. Aim at this one. See if we get a trick shot. We're going to try it again. There you go. Alright. Give me one of those, and then this should be able to get the kill. Bam! Good job. Come on, Parrish. Unload into this guy. Ooh, two lucky moves in a row. Give me the real unload now. Yeah, baby! That was good stuff. Okay, there he go. Ooh, he's still marked, which means he's a goner. Bam, baby! Who's left? Oh, there's one way over here. Well, how do you do? Uh, I guess go wake up, uh... Well, no, let's not have you wake up, Hydro. Use a med hypo, Chef Bear. And then get over here. Just gotta watch out for how much armor piercing they have, apparently, because, uh... Whew, they have a lot. Can't see how much they have, though. It's fine. Go ahead and save some points. Alright. Ow. Thank you for the party. Did I get a heal? Nope. Alright. Um, Jody, you wake up. Hydro, you might... Lucky heal bonus! Energetic! There you go. Gave him extra points. Of course it did, because they both got, uh... They both got lucky there. Okay, ambush. Alright. Punch him. Beautiful work. The uh, lucky... Lucky heal there made a difference, I'm sure. Pheromone sacks. Apparently are worth more. Neat! Okay, open up. Give me my stuff. That was a pretty successful mission, or successful battle, all things considered. I think we're actually gaining medic packs as we do these random encounters. Did we get more level ups, or we just have that many extra points to give away? No, Hydro got another level up. Alright. Well, I feel like you could definitely use the coordination and the awareness. Honestly, your hit chance is not that great. You could use a lot of things. 
to be honest. I'm actually going to go with intelligence. Every two points, he gains an extra skill point. That's another extra skill point to go around. Mm, I'm going to save up there. And as far as actual skills, I don't know what to give him here. Counter, I don't... I don't have that much faith in counter-offensive. I could give him trick shot, but he doesn't have that much... That many points in hit chance, you know? He needs more everything hit-related. So, you know what? Let's give him some extra points of evasion. I like that idea. Yeah. I should probably consider giving him leadership as well. I haven't given anyone on this team leadership, I don't think. Parrish doesn't have it, right? No. Yeah, and that would be a good thing to have on this team. Even if just for demoralize. I'll have to think about it, though. Alright. Let's keep walking. Got a need for speed? The turbocharger will make your Kodiak drive faster. Yeah, we got it. It's pretty nice. We scooted at a decent pace, from what I can see. We always end up turning toward the camera, though, I've noticed. Whenever we arrive on the world map. November, come in. We're getting a faint signal in your area. Hold one moment as I narrow it down. Okay. Here we go. If anyone can hear me, the elves are in danger. Sorry, the what? Help. Set a husband. He's a tyrant. What? Uh, hey, she, did you copy that? Negative, Team November. I did not copy. I definitely did not hear an elf cry out for help from the tyranny of Santa Claus. Just kidding, Team November. Okay. I'm sending you the coordinates of the signal. Hopefully it's not as bad as it sounds. Over. It will be. Oh boy. Uh, Santa's Workshop. I remember Santa's Workshop area in Colorado. It's a really cool little store. Um, I wonder if it's... Is it the same one? Nah, I don't remember this in front of it, but I could be wrong. Anyway, a charming little fake village. It used to be a Christmas-themed tourist trap before the apocalypse. I remember a big old... It was like a giant Christmas store. It was great. Let's go ahead and see if this reminds me of it next time here on That Plays Wasteland 3. Because that's going to be it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, make sure to let me know by giving a like. If you have any questions, subscribe for more and all that good stuff. Next time we're going to go to Christmas Town in Santa's Workshop. Thanks again for watching. My name is Thet, and I will see you in the next video, my dudes.